Hey guys, this is Greg Hill at iRacing, and we're really excited to show you today some of the new things we've been working on in the art and engineering departments. Now our objects around the track and our cars have long had what's called normal maps and specular maps on them, um, but with this build, it's going to be the first time that we have these on our racetracks. And I'll show you really quick um, what that will look like. Now this is New Smyrna. Uh, we shared uh, some screenshots of it yesterday in the forums and on Facebook, but here's the first live glimpse of it. So you can see the way the light is hitting the surface now and reflecting back different intensities and highlights on the asphalt particles and the, the grass. And you can see the drainage ditch appears to be three-dimensional or more three-dimensional than it really is. Now let me show you this on our new track, Twin Ring Motigi. Okay, here's our debut look at Twin Ring Motigi. Now I'm going to show you some detail on the curb and the asphalt surface that wouldn't have been apparent. Uh, previous to this new feature. All right, so let me show you really quick the effect on different types of materials such as Armco tires and asphalt as you've seen. Here's an Armco section at Twin Ring and it does not have the shaders applied to it currently. And here is the same section with the shaders. Uh, now you can notice the enhanced sense of depth and three dimensions to what is actually a two-dimensional surface as well as the specular highlights on the surface that are highlighting um, the way the sun is hitting the surface. Here's Twin Ring again. Shaders are turned off. You see a tire wall that has some subtle um, curves and folds in that material, but it's not nearly as apparent as when we turn on the shaders. Now we're all really excited to continue to work on this new feature and to revisit some of the older tracks in our library, and we intend on releasing updates with every build to numerous tracks. So here we're going to show you a quick glimpse at our new driver hand and driver glove. So we weren't satisfied with our original efforts and release, uh, was it half a year ago? And we decided we wanted to redo it. Much crisper, higher polygon count, higher resolution. And so we're going to take you around a lap of twin ring and you'll be able to see that for the first time in motion. Now right now we're working as hard as possible to add this to numerous, if not all cars, along with the upcoming build. Thank <laughs> you.